Residents on Padre Island and Flower and Bluff woke up without electricity. The beach out there was blocked by debris and sand left behind by the storm. Our Michael Gibson was out on Padre Island this morning and shows us what things looked like. We're out here on Padre Island, and as you can see, there's destruction up and down the beach. Here at Bob Hall Pier, the parking lot has been uprooted by that storm surge that Hurricane Hannah sent down this coastline. Chunks of the asphalt parking lot were all over the place. The cabanas, people used for picnics and shade out on the beach, were busted up and thrown against the dunes. Many of the huge concrete blocks people walk across to get onto Bob Hall Pier were in disarray after being lifted out by the storm surge. It was hard to see from the shoreline, but you could tell that the very end of Bob Hall Pier was missing. When I saw this, I'm like, oh man, I love coming out here. So, well, I just have to redo it again and hope uh, we got some good, get some good years out of it. That was Matt Kraft. He came out to the beach to do some kite surfing. And even though the waves were still wild, it did not appear that he had any problems navigating through the rough waters. Other folks simply came out with their dogs to take a walk on the beach. Others just wanting to take a snapshot or two. Around the rest of Padre Island, we saw the signal lights were out as well as the power to everything. We found this work crew at the Whitecap Access Road. They were working to clean up all the debris so that people be able to get back out on the beach tomorrow. Now, take a look at this. As I walked along the dunes, you can't really tell right now, but a huge amount of the dune structure was wiped away by the hurricane. You can really tell that by looking at the mile markers along the beach, which used to have a mountain of sand piled up right next to them. All of that is now gone. It's a lifetime opportunity. Out here in front of the Boathouse Bar and Grill, someone's going to have to get this boat out of the water. But the biggest job remains here at Bob Hall Pier, where Hannah did the most damage. From Padre Island, Michael Gibson, 3 News.